Hi, good evening. Uh, we are going to start today's session. Well, um, I give you a short introduction about our session, but um, we haven't discussed so far in detail about you know for, uh, uh, how to prepare your memorial. So today we are going to discuss about it. In case if you have any kind of question, please do feel free to ask. Um, the case law is already uploaded on website, so you can directly download it. Just figure it out what 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 is given there. But how to draft, you know, how to start. So before that, as I told you, like group number six, um, you can start forming your group. Just figure it out, uh, like you know, how you, how you can do that. You can discuss in your WhatsApp group and just decide who can be the researcher, who can be the speaker in round one. And as I told you, like there can generally what happens, you know, uh, we do have two speakers and one researcher, but it's an online conference. And in case if you want, you can be the two researcher and two speakers. But in round one, uh, if you're a researcher, so in round two, you can become the speaker. So like, uh, this is what uh, you, you you'll get opportunity. But the second thing is like, you know, once you completed, you know, uh, as a role, because you do have two options, you first you can become respondent, or maybe, you know, appealing. So Again, you know, once you'll finish it, so maybe next day, uh, when you'll have again two more rounds at that time, you have to change your role. Okay, great. So, just a second. Okay. So, here we go. And as I told you, the colors, if you are applicant, so remember you to choose blue color. And if you are responding, so you have to take red color, okay, in the beginning of your file. And, but again, well, because uh, you're going to have both the opportunities, so you should prepare both the memorial. Now, I told you about these uh, guidelines when you are going to prepare it. But remember, it's not hard and fast for online sessions. Okay, we generally don't expect legal legal papers here are generally you know when you're submitting hard coffee which is possible only in offline sessions so at that time uh, we are giving you instructions to for get legal papers and then you get it printed or whatever you want to do that so but in case you know we are not going to deduct your marks but at least you should follow the basic guidelines uh, in case one or put two points are not followed, that doesn't mean we are going to do the your marks. It won't happen. Don't worry. Now, let, let's talk about tonight. Let's talk about memorial. So remember, it's very important. The best way to start a memorial is to read the problem. So case study is already uploaded on website. Uh, in our last session, I already showed you about that okay and i told you just figure out like uh, uh like which article of indian constitution is important related to that and where actually you know violation happened so you need to read the problem carefully you know that is more important okay it will give you the clear-cut idea like how to draft your memorial so firstly issues should be decided Okay, just figure it out and divide it among team members. So that's why I told you like you start forming your team and divide your task accordingly. Okay, because you change your roles as well. So you decide like, you know, when, uh, when you know, uh, applicant, when you'll, you'll be applicant. So like who will be the researcher and when you'll respond in, uh, you know how to change the rule so this is how uh, it will make the work easier for all the team members and all the members can carry out their work accordingly so 
start forming it send me the list like we three or four are in a you know one team so this is how and then I start working on it now every mood or uh, you know like every code proceeding has two sides okay the appearance as I told you blue color and respondent you need to highlight red color so this is how we, we, we discuss this point earlier also so usually you have to prepare both the sides as I told you okay so you have to do that and a mood team comprises generally two is to one ratio so two means the speakers and one is a researcher but, but but I told you because it's an online conference and in group number two you do have liberty you can become two member as a speaker on uh, two as a researcher it's totally up to you whatever ratio you want just let me know so that i'll give you the permission okay but first you have to uh, you know form your group so you can you can discuss you are allowed to discuss you know with the group members the next one is uh you know every mood has two aspect you are judged on the first one is written submission that is your memorial and second one is oral submission so that you know when we'll have the main uh, sessions or important formal sessions at that time you know we are going to just oral you know oral submissions also the written submission uh, as i told you you know this is quite important uh, memorial so first one is cover phase that we have already discussed uh, you can watch that video in short okay uh which is having quite important points which is which is already mentioned there okay so the name of the forum before which preceding these are only one or two points but you just watch previous video okay uh which was discussed earlier i've shown you a, a kind of a sample okay even today i'm going to share you a sample uh memorial so that you can you know check it out but remember that is of different case you have to only figure out the points that you can take from there okay so name uh of the forum before which so as i told you this matter is actually related to supreme code of india and uh, and you want a review petition okay so that uh, you know whatever the fundamental right violation happened that should be you know compensated so uh, uh, that that is important now second one title of the competition and name of the case so all these things is actually given in your case law i'll i'll share you a sample copy as well so take out you know check out the points given there but your case study is already uploaded on your website okay so you have to take points from that case study uh, in case if you have any kind of doubt i'm always there to help you out so that you can learn and enjoy the sessions okay so whenever uh whenever we'll have offline session of course you can visit to new delhi or you can you can have a tour of supreme court of india but uh, for that you know um uh, you should have prior permission uh, then only you can visit there okay um now come to the next one <clears throat> uh, table of content so next po important point in your memorial is table of content okay and what is that it contains you know a list of chapters or maybe paragraphs or whatever is in there in your memorial that are included you know there and we can also mention page number or uh, paragraphs of your content and uh, by mentioning page numbers it will be easy you know for the judges and the speakers to find out you know mention argument and the argument is most complex part of the brief so therefore the headings you know and subheadings used within the argument section should be listed in the table of content with the corresponding page number and that will help you know to uh, check very easily uh, you know what is given in in, in your uh, memorial so that is again important and I'll, I'll whatever points are here i'm going to share this ppt as well as video a recorded video in your whatsapp group and one sample copy of memorial so that you can compare it 
and then you can start working on your own memorial with your own team members and wherever whatever problem you are going to get please feel free to contact me next one is index of authority so you'll find out you know the next point given in your memorial or it should be there when you're going to write down so it should be you know index of authorities so in this all the materials which support your argument have to be added in index of authorities okay the authorities of supreme court or the high courts of foreign judgment or maybe statutes means laws and the parliamentary debates are mentioned under this index of authorities okay so this is there's a kind of research work you know that you you need to do according to your case law and that can be the that can be the important point that you can add here and so sir, uh, refer through articles you need to mention which textbook so generally you won't have you know these textbooks because you're the not you're not a law student uh, i do understand um but what, what what you can do is you can directly visit on different sites and you know in your rop a few links are given so you can check it out these link, links also as well and directly it will take you you know to the important website so this is not only helpful for the speaker but also you know useful for the judges and other side is speaker to easily determine what case laws constitutional provisional provisions you know or statutes or other materials are being cited you know so you can take the reference you know, and you can cite here you can give the reference this is taken from this case law this is taken from that book or uh, this is taken from this debate parliamentary debate uh, this is how you can mention which is going to support you know uh, your memorial to earn good certificate uh, international IMCA moot court okay next point is list of abbreviations so remember uh, when you will check you know assemble copy of memorial there also you will find a you know list of abbreviation and even you need to add list of abbreviation which is going to help you a lot to earn good marks but remember whatever list of abbreviation is given whatever abbreviation you are going to use don't change it you know you have to use same in your memorial so it should contain you know all the abbreviations abbreviations used in your memorial each abbreviation should contain the full meaning and in the whole memorial same abbreviation should be followed don't try to change it so it also necessary for the speaker to know what abbreviation they are citing in their memory so that's very important now come to the next one statement of jurisdiction so jurisdiction uh, you know uh, this statement is quite important so jurisdiction is the most important part of the memorial the jurisdiction of the court should be clearly mentioned with a reason so you know um finding the proper jurisdiction is very important and judges uh, surely ask questions so here you have to pay extra attention so that in case you know whatever uh, uh, you know happened earlier maybe uh, judges can ask you question based on that uh so you you have to be very careful while writing it and be prepared to face you know uh, questions okay and uh, of course uh, uh in case you know um uh there is extra time so at that time you know maybe you you will have the next round that is rebuttal so at that time also that is important uh to answer the next one is a statement of facts okay so again i, I see again uh, i would like to tell you just check out the assembled copy of memorial you'll get all these points okay once again you you watch this video or maybe the ppd which i'm going to share with you um you can compare it ask your questions once again start working on a memorial with your team members so this point statement of facts or synopsis of fact is generally you know convince you know the court about your client's position and its point of view okay so uh just may be well versed in law but remember that just 
doesn't know about the facts of your particular case so you have to brief you know uh, you have to give a summary of facts have to be written very clearly in the beginning of the memorial but generally it should not be very big okay so that directly it can give the clear-cut message to the judge knowing of the facts in brief is very necessary so it is important for a speaker to go through the facts uh, you know carefully and only relevant facts should be mentioned in your memorial okay uh, um, i'm not expecting you know a very big uh, memorial of 20 pages which generally you know when we are conducting it in law colleges at that time they need to submit here it can be short it can be three to four pages okay that is more than enough for you guys so uh, um you, you 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 can just figure it out the important facts okay and facts should be uh uh you know should not be uninteresting it should be in a manner that a person enjoys reading and it proves on your side so the facts should not be assumed one okay don't try to assume but yes it should be the real as given in the proposition or maybe the real case law that uh, copy that is shared with with you guys now statement of issue is the next point in your memorial so what is that a statement of uh, you know issues so this is a short introductory statement of the legal issues okay as a kind of a, uh, a kind of an introductory part uh, uh, which points you know uh, law involved in the case so important points you need to highlight uh, you need to introduce your fact important issues and uh, tells the judges but what is important even you are going to you know uh, mention the statement issues so here in red color you can you can check it out these issues are stated in question form and should be phrased in such a way that it showed on its favor side okay so just uh, just figure out how issues are given in you know um in in the sample copy so these issues are very short and not lengthy remember it so as to make an individual understand the very essence of it they are not more than one sentence the sentence should start with whether or and add up you know end up with the question mark you know so like is it a violation of this and that video is uh, you know it's a violation of this article or going to get compensation or not so these sort of points you can add as per your case law now the next one is summary of argument so when i'm talking about so uh, just a second okay so when i'm talking about summary of argument so remember this is a brief summary of argument based on the issues raised uh issues uh, the, the, the previous one okay previous point and it is a short introductory of issues mentioned in your memorial okay each argument should not be more than one paragraph okay it's totally up to you i'm i'm, I'm really sorry i need to connect my power plug just a second fine so you know uh when i'm talking about the summary so it should be short yeah you, you can make it short okay it's only shows what you are you know arguing uh for in brief so that is again important okay now next argument in the advance you know is 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 again a very important point this is the heart and soul of the memorial okay why because every part of the argument must be supported by legal authority so argument should be well organized and convincing each point the team wants 
the code to consider in deciding the case must be described the reasons explained with the appropriate reference to research materials used and the tax citations should be inserted as frequently as needed so the argument should address you know legal precedent and the policy issues each part each part of the argument first addressed the issue supporting one's own case so the argument should be written in forceful forceful doesn't mean you know uh you're forcing but you you are emphasizing you know their your argument okay active and positive language try to avoid passive tense here it should be active headings and subheadings are used to help in clearly organizing the arguments the same as structure of heading and subheading should be summarized in table of content that you can mention so remember argument of advance is again important first you check out the memorial and just try to compare it with your own case law now prayer it should be at the end so a prayer means what what sort of you know decision you want what sort of judgment you want what sort of verdict you want at the end so that is your prayer okay what actually you want from the code of law so this is uh, you know it is the relief claimed by the parties which should be clearly mentioned more than one relief can be claimed in one case of action okay maybe you know punishment as well as compensation monetary compensation so depends following the prayers signature of the council must be stated okay so you you guys are the council member this act as the ending of the memorial remember so prayer should be at last that is your last point this clearly declares what an individual will be in a petitioner or defendant the person who is filing you know case law they are petitioner the person who is going to respond they are defendant okay so uh, in this you know uh, the relief mentioning sentence and in the uh, basic motive of filling the suit filing the suit actually or case is mentioned through the relief claimed so why are you actually you file the suit okay why you you went to the code of law because you want some kind of relief so that that relief should be mentioned here like you want this and that <clears throat> okay fine great so this was about the memorial uh today what you can do um i want you to form team as soon as possible and the second thing uh one one sample copy of memorial i'm gonna show you uh, i'm gonna i'm going to share it in your whatsapp group so that you, you just check it out the points only don't go through the case law but if you want you can figure out you know points but but you do have your own case law remember okay this is only for you know how to draft your memorial so this is the copy and team code instead of team code number was zero one you can write here oh six okay zero six because your group number is that okay before the honorable supreme court of india because the same case law i've given you so you have to present in that way okay that the special leave petition number you can take randomly uh because you know uh uh it's, it's not the the real one we can't take if you want you can take it from your original copy as well and make it 2021 okay just a second okay so 
and the article so remember don't write you know the same the article 136 just figure out your own case law okay and then and then petro oil corporation so here you write down your case law because it's uh, i in i think it was it is different you know it is uh, it is a person versus a state of bihar okay that you need to check it out so that person will become what appellant and a state of bihar is responsible i told you the meaning of a state in article 12 so there you you, you just you know, go through your case law and write down respondent in state of bihar okay so it's uh, and write down like a special petition under the article now you just find out which article violation of which article and uh, uh, especially petition under the article of 32 and violation of article 21 this is how actually it is there uh, here instead of writing you know uh, uh, honorable bombay high court so you can mention you know new delhi supreme court of india okay memorial uh, for the respondent but remember your first piece should be you know uh, should have color because here we, we can't, you know, in offline sessions, generally it's difficult to have, you know, hard copies. So you first, you just select color and then go with the second base. Now see, table of content, what I told you. So the, these are the table of content. Okay. And last prayer. So whatever the points are given, you can check it out. Okay, argument in advance, summary of argument, issues raised, statement of facts, okay, statement of jurisdiction, okay, all these points you can mention, index of authorities, list of abbreviation, so whatever we have discussed, in the same way they have drafted, and then this is how they proceeded, list of abbreviation and all, okay, then index of authorities, so tonight you check out all these things i'm gonna give you one more day like today and tomorrow you can work on it and whatever doubts you do have now you can start asking uh, on day after tomorrow like here you're having problem or these are the point which is not clear to you and in case you're, you're having any kind of problem while drafting it but the first and uh, for most important point is like first you uh, you know decide your team members the case law you already know so it's, it's actually done for today now do you do you want to ask any question from um Uh, so we're supposed to work on the memorial for the next two days mm -hmm. and submit it or just no 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 you you can start working 